I used to make moon water. I haven't done it for a while. But um, it's very powerful stuff because the energy that comes off the moon is um, very powerful. Also, what I would do is uh, get a load of bottles of water and just leave them under the moon um, overnight. And because of the period of time, they would, the water would soak up all the energy of the moon and um, it had a very strong effect. Um, I brought that up because, um, I can, uh, sort of feel the energy of the moon now a little bit, although I often have trouble feeling my feelings, um, and, um, yeah, it seems... There's always a theme with a full moon, and this one's been about manifestation. I think that's why I made some videos about manifestation. Um, you know, the beauty is in the detail, and uh, the details, and that beauty adds to the vibration of a manifestation. Um, what else was there? Uh, inspiration as well. Um, the reason we find things inspiring is because, um, um, because whatever it is that inspires us, we see a part of who we really are in that, whatever it is. And then, um, what else? Uh, I made one more. Um, detail, inspiration, and um, know thyself. Um, so, and that's about understanding who you are. It's about self love. And um, with that, um, self-love with that understanding about yourself um, you attract what resonates with your being because you're aware of what your being is you're aware of yourself um, so that's a higher vibration so you're flowing with more of your energy and then because you're flowing with more of your energy you're attracting um, things that resonate with your energy. Know thyself. Um, yeah, so this full moon is about... The theme behind this full moon is manifestation. Um, or one of the themes. Um, I would say the other theme is torture, but that's... Um, that's just what I've been experiencing for a long time. Um, uh, manifestation. Um, the other thing I wanted to talk about, although I've had, I haven't been able to express it yet was transmutation, um, which was going to be the next part of my manifestation series. So, transmutation, um, you know, um, on a low vibration throughout life, um, the suffering you experience will, as you understand who you really are and raise your vibration the things that you experience on a lower vibration will be transmuted because um, because all the energy in that suffering um, the only way the best way to 
carry it is to transmute it into strength. I'm sorry. Can't get it across properly. Uh, for example, if I was hurt in some way and I felt upset about it, um, but then I found the person who hurt me, then that pain, that sadness, whatever it is, I might turn it into anger with an understanding about how valuable I am. You know, like how valuable you are to yourself. It just didn't sound good. Um, and um, with that, with that understanding comes a lot of anger and then, you know, maybe, you know, it's just justice, it's, it's karma. That person that hurt you, they, um, the energy they put out there, they get it back. And, you know, then they're, you know, maybe they're debilitated in some way or whatever they did to you, they can't do it again because they're, they're missing the limb that they used to do it to you. Something like that. Um, and then you have a feeling of peace afterwards, like, well, maybe it won't happen again. And that, that is um, transmutation. You've transmuted the suffering you experienced unjustly into uh, a just um, ending. And then um, and you felt peaceful afterwards. And you learned something from the experience. That's... Uh, transmuting negativity or something, a negative experience. Um, there's other things, other negative experiences you can transmute. Um, I do it a lot. Um, I just wish I could um, uh, say it. It might come. Um, what do I transmute? Um, Um, yeah, look like uh, when someone makes fun of you and um, if someone's made fun of you plenty of people made fun of me um, you know and I turn it into a joke or I see it as a joke you know and, um, and it makes me laugh and that's uh, that's that's a great one I love to do that and that um, that's something that should come naturally with um, that comes naturally with uh, with understanding um, I'm going to try and uh, do a video about transmutation um, at some stage with a better better ex explanation explanation 